Power Apps Lesson 20. I'm very excited to be here. We're going to go into Power Pages development now. And so um, what uh, we need to do here is our user story being we have candidates who are in need of work and they are looking through uh, the job market and we want them to look at our job portal, which is called Power Apps Talent Engage. And we want them to uh, apply for our jobs if they are you know, qualified for them. So now we're creating that external interface for our uh, talent to connect with us and our internal systems that we've been working with all this time. So this is very exciting. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and click on edit this page. All we've done is create a start from blank page. So this is a from scratch uh, power page, but the uh, website is called Power Apps Talent Engage. Okay. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to let's edit our site header and let's call this Power Apps Talent Engage. And then maybe I can make like a logo for this that looks kind of nice later. Okay. But for now, I'm going to just leverage what I've got available to me and go from there. Right. Okay. Next thing. Um, let's go ahead and close this. And then anytime that you make a change, click on the sync button here. And this is going to kind of sync the configuration of the changes you've made. Think of it as like a publish. Think of it like that. All right. So the, the next part is really simple. We're going to create a uh, list. And this list right here is going to be a list of open jobs. We'll create a brand new list. And then we're going to create a list of active jobs and let's give our name or a list or a list name to this. So we'll call this open job postings. I think that sounds nice. Open job postings. Uh, we're not going to take any actions right now. We're just going to show the list. Here's kind of an example of what it might look like. Uh, useful, but really not that helpful. Why? Because the window is really small. So let's kind of synchronize this with the database and let's take a look. And this is going to be our very first video in a series of videos where we're going to expand upon this process. Because the next thing I want to do in our next video is allow our candidates to click on one of these jobs and drill down into the job and see if they're interested in the job description, some of the other things that are required of the job, et cetera, and then apply properly and create an application against that. Okay. So let's go ahead and uh, take a look. We can try to preview this page and see if it uh, behaves so we can preview it. You have options to preview it on mobile or desktop. Let's just look at desktop right now. We can always make things responsive later. And so here you have it. We have a list of jobs. It looks okay. It could look better. It looks like it's about 10 results per page. We can change that, but I'm pretty happy with the way this looks. So we've got um, the different values available here, and we can definitely go through sections of the site and look through. And we can even sort by company. You can see we can sort by uh, A to Z, and that's kind of cool. So uh, very much uh, a fan of Power Pages. Um, used to be called Power Apps Portals, ADX Studio. It is now Power Pages. And uh, so with that being said, thank you for watching this video. And in the next video, we're going to do some more fun stuff. Thank you.